Hey YouTube, welcome back to another video you guys. My name is Dineska. In today's video, I am actually doing a Shein haul slash try on haul for you guys. And um, yeah, just wanted to show you guys what I purchased and let you know what I think about it. So let's jump right in. First item I'm going to show you guys is some booties that I purchased from Shein. This is what it looks like. And um, it's kind of like some socks boots. I paid $25.16 for the purchase. Um, I purchased this in a European 41, which is actually a US 9 and a half. Now, normally in boots, I would wear a size 9. So, um, let me go ahead and try it on and show you guys what it looks like on my feet. Uh, this right here is what the boots look like, you guys. Um, I hope you guys can see it good. I'll have a picture available as well um, with me wearing them. Now, these boots are super soft. The inside is super comfortable. Um, I do want to say that um, it's true to size because I went half a size up and I could feel the difference as far as... Um, the sizing go. So, um, if I were you, I would stick to whatever size I normally wear because um, it is very true to size. So, they are a little big on me, but I'm going to go ahead and still keep these because I honestly don't like returning stuff like that unless if it's just like really trash, then I'll return them. So, yeah, you guys, soft material, and I just love them. To me, it looks like it, I don't know, it looks oversized on my feet, but it's still cute, and I love them. All right, you guys, so next item that I'm going to show you guys is going to be a shirt that I purchased from Shein, and this is a solid crop tee. Um, it's oversized in the picture, and I actually decided to go up a size. So um, this is in a size large. The material is soft. And to me, it looks like it's kind of see-through. Yeah, it's pretty see-through, but it's in... Um, and I paid $4.02 for this. I don't know. I'm show y'all what it looks like. Hold on. So for $4, I am not complaining, you guys. And while we are at it, um, I'll show you guys the other colors that I purchased it in. All right, you guys. So here goes the crop top in black. As mentioned um, earlier in the video, I did purchase these in a size large. And here I am just trying it on for you guys, trying to show you guys how it's fitting. Um, the material is 100% polyester, and this is what it's looking like at this point, you guys. And yeah, overall, I like it. Although it's a bit oversized, it's still cute. Let me know what you think. And here we go. The top in the color gray. And it's the same price. It's also a large. I'm normally between a small and medium. But as mentioned, I wanted to do a little extra oversized look. So that's what it looks like right there. Yeah. Okay, you guys, so next up is the sheet in base solid for the T in the hot pink color. This is also a size medium, and I like the way it feels. It has tons and tons of stretch in it. If you want, you can size up in this one. Um, yeah. All right, y'all, here is the sheet in bay high waist biker shorts that I purchased. 
The price on this was $5.21, you guys. I got this in a size small. To me, it runs big. Um, I don't like how high-waisted it is. I think if I would have gotten this maybe in a petite, it would have been better. Um, the material on this biker shorts is really, really soft. Okay, here I have the top to it, which is called the She and Babe Solid Fitted Tee. I paid $5.21 for that, and I got that in a size medium. As mentioned with the shorts, this is also pretty soft as well, you guys. Next up, I have this solid ruched off shoulder crop top and shorts. I paid $11.13 for this, you guys. As far as the fabric on the material itself, it isn't the type that would stretch but it does have stretch available in the waist as well as around the um top the um material for the top here and i went ahead and sized down on this this is in a size small and overall i love the way it fits all right you guys next up is the all over print mock neck blouse i paid ten dollars and 83 cents for it um it's is in the black and white color um it's actually more like a black and cream color but um overall i think it's cute i got this in a size medium i think it runs through the sides in my opinion it has no stretch though so um just be careful with that i like that the arms are oversized also the back of the blouse has where you can tie it up Next up is the She In Solid Rib Knit Asymmetrical Hem Tee and Legging Set. I paid $8.56 for this in the color black. Overall, I love the details in the material. Um, I did get this in a size medium. It has plenty of stretch. I love the details on the neck and how soft it is. Um, if you'd like, you can size down in this one due to the stretch. Okay, next up, I went ahead and um, put on this high-waisted ruch wrap hem leather skirt um purchased this for six dollars and one cents in the color brown and this is a size small you guys um overall it's cute um it's kind of short though so i'm not too sure about it but it's nice all right you guys at this point i went ahead and changed the bottom i did purchase the same outfit um in the color brown and the Brown set is also in the size medium. I paid $8.99 for that one. Um, in real life, though, it's more of an orange color. And um, I just, as mentioned before, love the details in the top as well as the, um, the pants. Now, this material, I think you can size down if you'd like. If I purchased it in the small, I think it would still have fit nicely. And I'm just showing you guys how long the um, pants is. Next up, you guys, is the solid round neck sweatshirt. I paid $6.82 for this. I got it in the color hot pink, and it's a size medium. I love that it's cropped. I love the material of the sweater. It's like a cotton tee. It feels really, really comfortable, and it'll definitely keep you warm. Next up, we have this tartan print lantern sleeve crop blouse i paid ten dollars and three cents for that one i got it in a size medium and um this i just love the way it's cropped i love the way the material feels it doesn't have any stretch in the actual shirt itself but it is oversized and there is stretch in the waistband and here i'm just showing you guys what it's looking like um i was a little bit confused as to how the buttons work on this top so you'll see me play around with it for a little bit but um overall i'm happy with this purchase and i love that the arms are so um spacious and all that good stuff if i wanted i could have sized down to a size small i think it would have fit just this nice so here i'm just trying to correct the buttons and yeah but i love it super happy with this purchase
Next up, you guys, I have this all-over print tie back puff sleeve. I paid $8.84 for it, and this was purchased in a size medium as well. Now, this material has no stretch whatsoever, but it does have the option of, um, it allows you to tie the back, so you don't really have to worry as far as whether or not it's going to fit. Um, but I think a size medium fits me perfect. And this is what it's looking like. I absolutely love the color. It's so cute. And, of course, once I'm wearing it, I wouldn't have the bra on. But it's just on for, the, for this video. But overall, I think it's really cute. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below, you guys. Next up, I have this tie front crop top and random all over print legging. Paid $13.70 for it. I got this in a size medium. And overall, it's cute. But honestly, you guys, I think I should have sized down. The top is just a bit um, too big, even though it has the tie option. It's just, it feels like it's too big. I could have went down to a small and I think it would have fit perfectly. And I'm normally between a small and a medium, mainly medium. Um, but with this one, I definitely would have sized down to um, a small. And it, the leg part is really nice. It goes all the way down to my ankles. I'm 5'3 in height. Next up, I have the Shein Unity Houndstooth Print Suspender Jumpsuit. I paid $5.99 for it, and I got it in a size large. Um, as mentioned earlier, I am normally between a small and medium, so anyone purchasing this, I would recommend you size up. It is really, really fitted. Also, um, the legs are kind of short. Last but not least, you guys, I'm going to be showing you guys this all-over print cut waist ruche slit side dress. I paid $18.47 for it. I got it in a size medium. And overall, I think I could have sized down. The skirt does not have any stretch to it, but um, it is pretty roomy. And then the top has where you can um, use the strings to tighten. So if you'd like, you can definitely size down in this. All right, you guys, so you saw my complete try on haul. Um, overall, I am super pleased with my purchase. Everything fit just the way I wanted it to, with the exception of a few items being a little oversized. But overall, I'm keeping everything in this purchase. Um, you guys, please make sure you go ahead and like. Make sure to leave me some comments. Let me know which one of the outfits were your um, top three. And yeah, make sure you um, like, comment, and subscribe, you guys. She in, if you guys are looking for a sponsor, you guys, I am available. Just go ahead and reach out to me. You can follow me on Instagram or reach out to me on Instagram. All the information will be down in the description box, you guys. And just thank you for viewing today's video. Ciao.